uh, two friends that are writers. Their styles are different, but for me, it, it's just an amazing thing that they can write down their thoughts and have a flow. Um, these friends of mine I used to work with at the museum, and it's Lee and Joe Koch, um, brilliant people. I uh, always looked up to them. Um, now, this is my interpretation. Now, some people may see it and just think, oh man, I've lost my mind. Um, if you <laughs> create a, a scenery picture where there's trees, I'm gonna zoom in this so you see some of the detail. This is all watercolors. I'll explain everything in just a minute. Um, and <laughs> this is, for me, I can't write like them, but I could tell a story with my, my work. Now, some people see scenery pictures and it's kind of like, well, tree, mountain, okay. And they could discuss things and say, <clears throat> oh, the colors in the sunset are great. And, and, and you know, the vibrant colors and it, it makes sense. And it's like, okay, finish up the analysis of that in a short amount of time. <clears throat> this may take a little time. This is my interpretation of Dante's Inferno. Um, now, there was nine levels. So if you look right here, there's nine of these tubes, which some of them are realistic in the beginning of the way a heart works. I, this heart happens to have a tumor. And I'll get in closer for some of that detail stuff. Um, these insects, um, there's all kinds of things happening, but there's a reason for them. Um, like I said, Dante's in, in Inferno is nine levels. So up here, this is limbo. <clears throat> and you can see they're floating. Their eyes look kind of, there's a thumbprint signature on this. Um, and then you have these praying mantis eating away at the heart. Heart represents heresy, which starts in the heart. And these insects praying mantis are eating like crazy so this represents gluttony and fraud because they don't look like the normal praying mantis they're camouflage and that's the way they really look you look down here and you see all these pieces of insect pieces and it's violence to me um you see these insects down here now these are insects that have been stabbed in the back. Treachery. Uh, it, 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 there's just all these different things that I see that may not people would get. This dung beetle. I know it's a kind of a weird thing. But this is my interpretation of gluttony. He's hoarding, hoarding his little cache of fecal matter. Uh, so this is kind of what I really like because this is a combination without words, um, but it tells a story. And uh, this is my way of writing. I'm a horrible writer. Uh, I'll admit to that. Um, but this is a process that has taken... And I, and I hear this all the time. How long did this take? And truly my only answer could be 60 years. Because um, I couldn't have painted this the way it is. It took all those years to get to the point where I am right now. Um, but I just wanted to share how my weird brain works. Alexa, what's the definition of non-duality? Non-duality refers to the belief that everything in the universe, including yourself, is not separate from the ultimate reality of being aware. It is a concept that suggests that there is just one universal entity, which appears as a multitude or the universe. 
Anyway, um, so I just want to share this, um, my weird brain, the way it works. Thank you. Hello, um, I'm Steve Melendres, a model maker, illustrator, scientific illustrator, sculptor, design after history museum in Los Angeles. Done a lot of different things, um, but I'm going to be doing watercolor demonstrations of the techniques I've developed over the years. Um, and it's going to go from a lot of different directions. And also I'm going to be doing videos. Uh, I call them video posters for my daughter. So a lot of stuff that I can leave to my daughter about her crazy dad. <laughs> so um, I'm taking a lot of different directions, but mainly three. Um, so anyway, that's my introduction that I'm going to attach to every thing I'm doing now. So I don't have to repeat this.